YouTube, YouTube, what up? It's your dog. Old school car fanatic. You already know what it is. Please go hit that like and subscribe. Nah, but for real, man, you know, what is you doing it for, man? What motivates you to wake up and do everything that you do every day, man? Is it your family? Is it your goals? I mean, you know, man, it comes a point in life, man. For me, I'm going to just tell you about me. I have outgrown so many things, man, that I'm, I'm, I've done found peace. And it's, it's so peaceful that I don't want it to be taken away. I can't remember the last time I've been on the scene. I've been out at the club. You know, I used to miss that shit, man. Pulling up, showing out, all that, man. I, I used to love it, man. Believe me, I used to love it. But, you know, I was real reckless. But I used to love pulling up on the scene and showing off. You know, I, I, I watched a sermon today. You gotta excuse me. A lot of airplanes going by. I'm by airport. I watched a sermon today, man. It's at a church in uh, Rochester, New York. And the sermon, and it, the pastor said, keep the door closed. What God got for you ain't for the world to see. And that touched me personally, man. Me personally, it touched me because I got caught up in the social media wave and everything that I do, that I buy, that I accomplish, where I'm at, you got to post it on social media, right? You know, man, everything ain't for everybody. And what you post and put out there in the universe for the world to see can harm you in some way. Or people always going to judge you or something. You know, sometimes it's best to just keep your life and your blessings to yourself, right? But it's hard to do because we caught up in the world of recognition. That's that world shit. Like, that ain't godly. Excuse my language. That's not godly. That's the world. We want to be recognized for everything that we do. But when you find real peace... You know, I mean, I, and I'm not, don't get me wrong. I don't want to sound like a hypocrite, man, because I do something nice and I post it online and I'm proud of my accomplishment, my car, whatever, whatever I post it online. But I'm slowly growing out of putting my business out there for the world to see. You know, and I sound like I'm probably contradicting myself. I like to do FYI videos and, um, you know, and just talk and share knowledge, man. But you know, and on this road, on this road, and on this mission of growth, man, you got to keep some things for yourself. You got to keep the door closed. People are gonna see what you're doing. You ain't gotta advertise it because you know why. You giving the enemy an advantage because they know how you feel. They know what you're doing. They know that deal. They know what you're doing because you know why? You put it out there every day. Or, or you always posting something you got going on. You know, a picture says, what they say? A picture says a thousand words. All you got to do is post a pic, man. And people are going to hate and envy you just off of a picture. They're going to have so many opinions and shit to say about you off a fucking picture. You know what I mean? So, I ain't want nothing much, man. Just come over here on, on, on YouTube. Have, you know, I got to drop a video once a week, man. You know, I got to do that, man. You know, I, and that just is what it is, man. Love yourself. Respect yourself. Please go hit that like and subscribe. Shut the door on the world. The world ain't got to see everything. Do what you do for you. And stay true. This your dog, old school car fanatic. Peace.